extending your outriggers. It's really easy. You go out, take the BTT, set up the machine, stand here and take it back. So this was for us important to rely on the familiar things. Yes. The yeah. hands of guys like today. Because Tony, I think you see it also when we started Le Contour with this. The most of them said, oh, I want to have my outrigger control unit. This is bad, this is not good. No. Meanwhile, they say, I love it because I can go there and there where it is interesting for me, where I yeah. have to look. Yep. But then they were also moaning that they were having to sort of go up yep. two steps and, and then you're having to reach over. Yep. So by putting it here, Absolutely. that's a lot, a lot easier. Do you want to take a seat? Of course. <laughs> Maybe you can also on the other side. You can turn on the ignition. So the leak on is pulling up. The new look. This dashboard is something else. It's all touch screen. On, on the radio, on it. a cooler, yeah, a cooler box, yeah, and a cooler box, installed rings, yeah, and here you see automatically climatization, yeah, like we have uh, already at Lake Contour in the upper cap, so he only says the temperature, it's automatic cooling and heating, yeah, yeah, and here you see them for us completely free programmable display unit, you can take into with the multifunctional steering wheel and get information directly this way. Yeah. You can see here the pressures of the of the uh, axles of the axles. Yeah. Yes and also information's right. Locks of the axles, steering programs, tire pressures. At the moment there are question marks because the tires are not running. Right. As soon okay. as they're running then you get the pressure displayed. Yeah. Yeah. Also, you hear the possibility for driver settings. One cool thing is, now you can activate the heating of the superstructure cap directly here by remote. When you're driving to ah, the job site, yes, yes, you can perfect. say here, please heat my upper cap. When I arrive <laughs> to the job site, I can go from one, one warm cabin yeah. to the next. So when you're in a cold country like Scandinavia correct. and that, you think, oh, I'm half an hour away from the job now. Yeah, correct. You set the driver's cap. Correct, the... and then go into the warm cabin. And as you see here on the back, it's the same remote control unit like on Lycon 2. So yes. you can also use from a Lycon 2 machine this control unit oh, and can, operate remote them, yeah. operates to Lycon 3 machine. That's a lot oh. of space. Yeah, yeah. As also, well. this was for us important to uh, improve the trays, the boxes to stow everything. Yeah. Also, here you have a storage box underneath here. And now, underneath okay. here are the, the electrics. Here's a storage box. Yeah. Even comes with a... Uh, here we have a flat storage box in the front. And uh, what about on top there? Is this a storage box? No, or? this is, no, no this is just, box. This is just yeah. Correct. Yeah. Also we have here that integrated uh, reverse camera. And that's just the standard. Yeah. That just comes. No, this is this is optional. Standard oh, is, is optional. a normal radio, yeah. but okay. the most customers are buying this yeah. because it's not it's expensive. Out, yeah. You have the um, and it's reverse camera well. correct. And what is also cool, when you open this box there is a cable inside. Yeah, I've already yeah. Found, yeah. Connect connect the cable here with the um, USB socket, correct? This one here, yeah. yeah. Connect it. And I will show you something. This is really cool. You connect it to my iPhone. Then we will see, we can use Apple CarPlay. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. So we have Stunning, yeah. navigation, for example, let us go to shop. <laughs> Let's search Hi. shopping. Yeah, okay, to go to the Rewe. No. Start. So we have a completely navigation inside of our mobile screen. And now obviously we'll also play your podcast, your radio. Correctly. Everything correctly via Apple CarPlay or Android Auto. Yes, you have completely all functionalities. That's brilliant. Yeah, and here you have via remote or via keys the yeah. most important functions. For example, the steering programs, the axle locks, 
or here the suspension, yes. lower yeah. lo and and, uh, and higher it and the lighting, all important functions directly can be controlled. Don't Eight. have to go in at inside of any menu or anything else. Take yes. your hands and correctly. Yeah. Only the functions which are not that important all the time. For example, this situation of the preheating of the cab. Yeah. You said okay, you can do it with the multifunctional steering wheel. But everything what you need the whole day while driving the screen directly can be activated here it's via the buttons. Yeah. It just makes it a lot more comfortable for the operator, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Which is a, hop, uh, a happy operator, happy operator is a happy sight, isn't it? And they look after it. And they look after it. More pride. Yeah. You know, you get something like this, yeah. you're going to take a lot of pride in it. Correct. Yeah, that's a box. Yeah, that's yeah. The call box is brilliant, yeah. idea. Yeah. Here you have the, uh, um, the how it's called, speed limiter um, and... Cruise control. Cruise control. Cruise, cruise, Correct. Cruise control, yeah. Perfect. Thank you. Should we have a look? 